guys. I wanted to show you guys. I got my freaking merch on. Look at this crap. This is dope looking. Benny SGB. Link in the description of my merch. If you want to just go check it out. Even if you don't, don't want to buy it, just go check it out. It's cool looking. I finally got merch now. So yeah, just showing down the video. Okay, so today I got an unboxing video for you guys today. Um, I am unboxing a new Nintendo Switch accessory. Um, it's a controller, so pretty cool. It's basically a pro controller. Finally, I got a pro controller. I used to use this as my kind of pro controller because I had an adapter. Finally got the Nintendo Switch official pro controller, basically, I guess. So this one's by Power A. Um, this is an enhanced wireless controller, so pretty cool. It's an official Nintendo licensed product, but it's made by Power A. Um, also, this is a Super Mario Bros. Edition uh, Target exclusive, so pretty cool. I actually got two of them. I already opened the first one, so I'm going to open the second one for you guys on camera. Um, so, yeah. So, let's check it out. Overall, the front looks freaking dope. Look at this. You 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 see this on the shelf at the store, and you're like, yo, I gotta buy this. It's a Super Mario Bros. on the top. You can see, like, the fire and stuff. Damn, this controller's dope looking. On the side, we just got some quick... We just gotta look at the controller itself. Just picture on the other side, the back of it. The cool thing about the Power A one is that it has two buttons on the back that you can program... Um, you can set for any button on the controller, so it's two extra buttons. It almost reminds me of like the Xbox uh, Elite controller, something like that. On the back, it basically talks to you about how you can set up the two extra buttons, and also talks about how it's, it has motion control. The only downside of this controller that I could think of is that it does not have the rumbling feature. I don't really care about rumbling on a controller. Maybe the Xbox when I'm playing shooters, but for the Switch, you know, what are you gonna need to rumble for? Splatoon? Like, <laughs> one day if they have Call of Duty or something or Halo on the Switch, then I'll need rumbling. But for now, I don't really care about rumbling. Um, so yeah, let's get straight into the freaking controller itself. Okay. A few inches later. Okay. So first thing you get, you get a manual that basically tells you about the controller kind of tells you how to connect it and different buttons on it here is the controller itself damn thumbnail <laughs> just kidding um but here we go pretty oh this controller is freaking dope looking look at this you got mario fire mario on there you got a chain, you got a, uh, I was about to say chain shop, piranha plant, dope looking, the whole thing is black, and then you got the silver d-pad, oh my god, whoever designed this, props to you. We got some nice triggers, pretty fat triggers, um, I'm just gonna compare this to the Xbox One controller as they're basically the same, they're the same size in all. The only major difference between these is that the Xbox One has, has rumble. And the Xbox One is way heavier than this controller, um, even with batteries in it. So that is the major difference I see. Pretty fat triggers. Look at this. Bumpers and triggers. Nice. Um, also, one thing I wanted to say. These freaking joysticks have so much travel. If you're a competitive gamer or anything like that, you'll love these sticks. Very nice sticks. I love these sticks. Really cool. Um, fat buttons. Look at that crap. Look at those buttons though. Freaking giant. So the D-pad's pretty sturdy feeling. You got the home button and the capture button and stuff like that. Pretty solid. Pause. Uh, plus and minus buttons on here. On the bottom you got the lights to sync up, sync it up to your switch. And basically the main attraction, what most people care about this controller is it's different. It has two buttons on the back. Um, you know, they're just pretty pretty standard buttons nothing special um the, i like the click to i'm really like tactical feeling and also this is the button that allows you to program these buttons so if you hold this button down um this the light on the on the front will start blinking and then you can program the back buttons to whatever button you want basically so yeah pretty pretty nice controller i like it also what i like about this controller is it actually freaking comes with batteries nintendo or power a you guys are the freaking heroes you included batteries 
people like me that never have batteries. So this just tells you your your switch has to be on version 6.0. So just a note, if your version if your switch version is like maybe 5.7, something like that, this controller will not work on your switch. So just a note. There's a there's lights on the bottom that sync your switch up. Pretty cool. It tells you if you're player one, two, or three or four. One, two, three, or four. Um, so yeah, that's basically the controller. Pretty nice controller. Um, I've been using the controller for about a week now. Um, as yeah, I got two of them. I've been using the other controller for about a week now. First impressions, pretty solid controller. I like it. I've I've used the Pro controller once before at a convention. Um, this feels about the same, just kind of more plastic, plastic here. Is that even a word? More plastic feeling. Um, but yeah, this controller is pretty solid. I don't know. I'll put a link in the description to where to buy this. Target.com maybe. Maybe Amazon will have it. I'm not sure yet. But yeah, that's, that's the, that's the $40 Pro Controller. Pretty nice controller. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. Go check out my merch. Link in the description, teespring.com slash BennySGB merch. Go check it out. Get a hoodie for yourself. And if you do, tell me in the comments. I will for sure shout you out. Um, so yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitch. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.